Hey guys and girls, welcome back to a, another beautiful video on this beautiful channel, this beautiful day as always. Hope you're doing great. Um, so today we're just going to keep working on the flash system. But before we do, please check out the description box. All the nice links. Um, yeah, drop a like, subscribe if you like the content. But let's get going. So when I'm working with the character and we're doing shit, um, we're fighting, going crazy, we're going ham. And we need to heal. Okay, so I'm just going to open combat state.h. Now, <clears throat> now, now that we have all the functions required, let me just see where, where that thing comes in. So here you go. Here's the heal. Okay. I do get the menu bar and then you can choose to heal. And then we update the menu. So three character dot reset. I gotta see what character dot reset does. Character dot reset. A full reset. So we do HP, stamina, mana. Uh, then I obviously need this flasks equal this flasks max and we're not going to use this function this is basically just to reset the character what i'm going to do is i'm going to do consume flask so it's going to check for flasks remove a flask reset the hp and then return true uh, so if we go back here and i'm going to put this in an if statement if this character consume flask okay if that allows me to do that uh, then I'm gonna do GUI alert uh, consumed a flask and gained HP gained HP now consuming a flask resets the entire HP it does reset the entire HP what I want to do though is create another variable flask heal All right, it's gonna be an amount that we're healing okay so it's gonna be an amount is better than just healing everything at once because then we can use level this flask heal equals maybe 10 so it heals for 10 okay um, multiply by the level so so that's good flask heal um, good good else no flasks flask was empty flask Flasks are empty. Flasks are empty. Boom. And then, yeah. Yeah, pretty much, pretty much, pretty much. Pretty much. Um, okay, okay. So, but what I need to do then, I need to go into character.cpp, into consume flask, and remove this reset HP. Okay, so then we're going to say this this HP plus equals this flask heal multiplied by this flask level okay and then we're gonna do it if this HP is greater than this HP max this HP equals this HP max so there you go so we're gonna add something to it and if it goes over the max HP, then we're just going to set it to max HP. So boom, we're good. And then we can consume our flasks and and get on with the healing. Um, and then I'm going to use the message alert up here as well. I missed that. You flee and lose some valuables. You flee and lose some valuables. And then... 
MSG error. And what did it say? Not a valid option. Not a valid option. Okay, so that's cool. That's fine. So now we can use our um, flasks. And and when we when we fight the enemies, gain item, gain flask shard. All right, we should be able to gain fa flask shards as well. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to do int shard drop equals random to 100 plus 1 and it should be really hard to find a f shard basically so if shard drop is greater than or less or than or equal to 2 or 3 maybe something like that very low chance um, then this character uh, and then we gotta we gotta create a function to add flash shards. Um, Character dot h. Where do I have all my flash shard items here? Great flask. Void add shard add flask shard. Okay. So that should just add one at a time. Should be very easy, very simple, very simple function. This flask shards plus plus. Very, very simple, very, very simple function. But we can call it from outside. Add flask shard. Okay. And then add exp, add gold. How does that, does these, do these write out? No, they're booleans. Oh, okay. So here I print out the stuff. Gained EXP and gained gold. New line, new line. Okay, so I'm going to copy one of these. I think I forgot to use C out above. But we'll see. GUI message alert. Gained a flask shard. Add it to inventory. Just making this look good, just like I want it to. Okay, so that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Um, now I just need to see if I added the GUI thing up top or down here to the menu. Um, no, I did not. So you have to do the C out here after each one of these. There we go. Okay, so flea returns some kind of string. Yeah, we'll see how all this works out. We'll just we'll just keep it like this. Okay, so that's cool. That's fine for now. Um, cool, right on time. All right, so um, flash shards, all good, all good. Start game, character menu. Let me just look in the stats. So everything looks fine here. Flask level, flash shards, flasks, and all that stuff. Um, enter. Oh yeah, I need to see. I need to see the inventory as well because we changed that before. Show inventory. So random armor type armor, armor type chest, chest chest. Um, cool, cool. So we're just gonna. We're just going to go ahead and go attack. And how do you do that? Travel menu for enemy encountered. Okay, so now I see everything's happening. Uh, begin combat. I could heal. All right, so let me just begin combat. Hope he hits me a little bit. Nope, I'm too good. Too, too good. Let's try again. Um, begin combat. 
There we go. Okay. Um, so now, if I were to go back to the menu, travel again, get into combat, uh, then I could heal myself, consume the flask and gain HP. So now I have 11 out of 11 again. Flask, 1 out of 2, and all that stuff. So begin combat. Let's kill this dude. Uh, begin combat. Item dropped. Still none. Still no. Oh god, sorry for all the sounds, you know. Uh, ooh, this is, this is, ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Okay, so now I would, I should be able to heal. Even if I'm dead, so I heal. Consume the flask, so I got 10 HP. And then begin combat, probably gonna die again. Okay, so it doesn't really matter, but there we go. Flasks kind of work now, like I want them to, so zero out of two. Um, it should say I don't have any flasks if I try to use one later. Uh, so yeah, pretty much, pretty much, pretty much. Cool, guys and girls. There you go. So now we, we got that working. So in the next video, probably, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Um, probably do something cool, something fun. Either add these cool skills or, yeah, something like that. Add, add some kind of item merging thing or something like that. Something cool anyway. We'll see. But thank you for watching this video. Thanks for sticking with me. Thanks for all the support. Take care. Hope you're all doing great. And just keep keep working hard, okay? And, um, yeah. I'll see you guys and girls in the next video. All right? Bye-bye.